I still got to put some silicone around the top and, and around the sides. Uh, but that's uh, how she looks. And everything's working. And gate's open. Now that you know the code. And one thing to keep in mind, this one had a Transcore toll tag reader and an AMKP hooked up to it. And I was locking the gate open so residents wouldn't have to wait. It was showing that it did not recognize the codes. I was like, oh, that's weird. But if you have the gate locked open, it shows some kind of weird code, like denied code, denied invalid code, blah, blah, blah. So just keep in mind when you're setting it up and you're testing it, if you come up with a, an error in, in the uh, database validation and you have the gate locked open, or I guess technically locked closed for that matter, although I don't really see very many people ever using... Uh, locked close um, unlock the gate and then see what's going on I think that's about it so a 1000 plus installed it's Friday it's time to go home and uh, subscribe to the channel safeguard controls Dallas Texas we do automatic gates audio video video surveillance access control and all around nice people